lifetime i've been looking forward to today for a very long time and uh, i'm happy that it finally came with i'm um, with good health and uh, i'm looking forward to my success now how, the, how does it feel to not have your twin sister here it's rather unfortunate that uh, she couldn't be here because uh, we actually never planned for it okay. we never planned for it just just a brief planning and if i'd known that it's going to be like this maybe she would have traveled out but because of the short notice Maybe by week and have planning. That was why it was like the and it's so sad that she couldn't be here. It would have been better, but we're still going to enjoy ourselves. What is the prayer you have for you and your twin sister? Well, what I would say is that uh, I pray to God to let us have a long life with good health so that we can always celebrate the next birthday together. Well, what I would say is that uh, they should cultivate the habit of love. Because uh, if you see my twin sister, you you will know that uh, you will even believe that she's my wife. Because we are inseparable. Only that she has to be with her family there and I have to be with my family here. You get it? So I will encourage upcoming twins to show that love for each other. You get it? Yeah. That you have blessed both of them with father lord god they will witness many 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 achievements of these seeds in good health in jesus name father lord I mommy needs for that prayer she took me to church there and thank you again to our special band tonight you're still going to hear more from them I followed you 
I just wish you like every you know thing you wish for in life, your heart desires, God will grant them. God will locate, He will anoint and exalt in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. <laughs> Where have we start? Tibo is such a wonderful person. A brother, a friend. Um he has a good heart. I've known T Boy for about 25 years now. Overall, he's just a wonderful person, really. He's a wonderful person. I came from the battle because of Tibo. I've been in Lagos in about three and a half years. But I came today because of Tibo. I only come to Lagos when I'm traveling out of the country. When I get back, I go get a Tibo. I don't like Lagos. <laughs> but Tibo brought me today. And I'm happy I'm here because I'm part of Tibo's family. My name is Judy Ayola. They call me Donkey. Eshin Don Don. Thank you. You will be your protector, you will be your provider. Another thing I want to say about you is that you're a caring father. He always remembers that a particular time of the week he has to be with his children. Either to take them out or to be with them so that at least they will know that daddy has come this week. So I say thank you for that, that you are not only a loving brother, but you're also a caring father. Thank you very much. Okay, so it's my uncle here, yeah, so Uncle Teddy is, is a very loving person and I feel very happy that he's turning 50 today. He has always been like someone you can always relate to. Like when I was in secondary school, Uncle Teddy was always, oh, if you come and give me this, you know, you just come and come and wind me and no worry, I'll keep you back home. <laughs> okay, okay, so like, it's always someone that you can relate to and I'm very glad that you managed to win. They are turning 50 They turned 50 yesterday. Um, Tiny, well, I guess he's a, like you've all said, a jolly good friend. Yeah, I remember, I think it was about 20 years ago, when uh, my younger sister felt he was taking too much liberty and getting, not getting it right and decided he should relocate to Lagos. It was a punishment, really. It wasn't, uh, it wasn't something he desired at that time. But his movement to Lagos has been a wonderful adventure. Um, He's done well with his partner in crime, Kumi. And uh, like Kumi said earlier, if you are looking for Tai, you will find it with him. And if you are looking for Kumi, you will find Kumi with Tai. Oh, 